Also, though, let's talk about this very briefly here. As COVID lockdowns ease up across China, shares of some of the U.S. listed Chinese stocks, Alibaba, JD.com, for instance, they are making ground in hope of erasing their monthly losses here with more. Uh, well, actually, no, with more reopenings occurring across the country. We're here with more. Uh, with those reopenings across the country, quite frankly, we could possibly see a strong month ahead for the China stocks. Tossing to ourselves here uh, is what I was doing there. But I think ultimately at the end of the day, this is this is a story about kind of fulfillment. When we think about all of these brands, JD.com, Alibaba, fulfillment, being able to have kind of full operating procedures back in motion after some of the lockdowns that had taken place. Uh, and there was actually a stat from Henry Ren over at Bloomberg noting that the NASDAQ Golden Dragon China index, 81 Chinese stocks in the U.S. That was down 1.1 percent in May through Friday um, and the close on Friday. A result of re failure to reverse the loss would result in actually the index's seventh monthly drop, longest streak since 2001. You know what excites me more than Alibaba as a company sitting on my lawn and watching grass grow? Uh, it's just one of those black box type of companies who never truly what knows what in fact they're doing. They have cloud operations, retail operations, and I, your point well taken. On these openings, you're going to yeah. see a sentiment lift in these beat up Chinese stocks. But I look at Deutsche Bank, they're also out cutting their price target on uh, the likes of an Alibaba, citing quote near term. Uh, near-term challenges and economic uncertainties in their business. I get the I get the rally here a little bit, um, but still, again, you're going to have to think it's going to be about a year before this company's fundamentals turn around. Yeah, I mean, if you don't want to watch your uh, your grass grow, you can just watch <laughs> your paint dry. Uh, Sherwin Williams stock is up uh, big pre-market from last I checked. Love their paint. <laughs> yeah, so keep tracking that one for sure.